boom what is up guys welcome back to another video we're here with cam the intimidator rides again yes sir i got a kevin harvick shirt on i'm, I'm about to change it though because today's a big day it is sunday may the 21st we already kicked it off with a bang going to the life point community church in elkin north carolina with ethan gephardt and his whole family that was absolutely a time shout out to trey he's a real g um but yeah we're at the track now. It is two o'clock. We have a meet and greet with Eric Estep, long time, long time subscriber since I was ten years old. I like. I originally liked him for the stop motions. Now me and Cameron just use him for our NASCAR news. But we're gonna meet him at three o'clock, hopefully, unless he just looks at Cameron and tells us to go back home. Hey. <laughs> I don't know. I've been saying a lot of random stuff today, but gotta get on our throwback outfit and go to the track but the all-star race is tonight the all-star open i'm super pumped a bunch of shirtless men are outside right now grilling steaks in the parking lot in the field and that's just nascar for you but i'll uh, i'll see y'all when we get in the track it's all-star race day baby all right we are here at the north carolina moonshine and motorsports hauler we got brandon pool we got a sign here we got a zoom out here oh my goodness and yeah, we got a sign to We'll have a sign hero card. We just got a hero card, some stickers. Eric Estep, out of the groove legend. Cameron and his watermelon snow cone. How you enjoying it, buddy? Good. That's good. But yeah, we got a huge crowd of people, as you can see. It's real busy day. Obviously, the race is sold out. Luckily, we know the people that we're sitting next to we're pretty tight with. But uh, out of the groove, man. He's a guy. He's a legend. Been watching him since we were 10. Got a picture with him. Maybe that'll be the thumbnail. Who knows? But good stuff. Um... We just had the opportunity, as you saw in the thumbnail, to meet Eric Step. I also got a picture with the iceberg. I might throw it in. Who knows? But super cool experience. Literally started watching this man 10 years ago for stop motions. And now me and Cameron every week. Like, I think we've already said this 100 times now. But we're, I'm just I'm starstruck right now. I'm so happy. Such a nice guy. They all were. Um, just the NASCAR community, especially when these big YouTubers come out and support the fans. And they're so down to earth and kind it's super nice to see but shout out to eric Step and out of the group if you haven't subscribed to him go subscribe and if you're watching this eric i appreciate your kindness and your willingness to take pictures and spend a little bit of time with us but we're walking around the merch stands it's absolutely packed out today and uh yeah but great start to the day so far gotta admire mr bobby allison right here to my knowledge part of the talladega gang unless i misspoke oh that dude's got the best throwback outfit of the day that's a sick outfit anyways Oh, this man, this man just got a, just got a pick with, over, yeah, we'll have to throw these pictures okay. in, I don't even care, we'll do it. This is bugging me. Okay. And it says good, you're right here. Talk to us, yep. Because these are tires. Ooh, I bet Inex had to do something with this. I That's, think. that definitely is our legend car tires, you can see, yeah. All right, folks, we're sitting in the number 24 DuPont Chevrolet. Jeff Gordon, let's zoom away, and I won't let us near. Got our gas pedal, brake, and clutch. Look at this. We're in the we're in the rear view mirror. We got everybody out here. This is good stuff. Good times. Yeah, all the fans. This is a good place to just chill out. Cool stuff. Jeffrey.
All right, I didn't get the end of the race, but that was absolutely chaotic. Michael McDowell, Ty Gibbs were exchanging blows. Michael McDowell sold the bag. He did. Josh Berry and Ty Gibbs got in, which we predicted. Ty Gibbs would win, but they would both get in. It's the two best cars. Well, Ty should have won. Michael McDowell didn't get out of his way. Yeah. Then Noah Gregson with the damaged car got in because one of the most popular drivers. So that's not a surprise. AJ should have got in. Yeah, it's a heartbreaker, but we uh, we might have to get our friend Johnny some die cast. He Johnny! Might, Johnny! He might have to get a Noah Gregson shirt. We'll see. But All Star Sun All Star Sunday's kicking off in less than an hour, baby. It's gonna get wild. We're going for a million dollars, baby. Million dollars, baby. Quick halftime break. We're 100 laps in. My phone's about to die, so we're going to make this quick. Uh, Kyle. Kyle Larson is him. That's all. Go. That's it. Morning guys, it's obviously the next day from all the North Wilkesboro festivities and races and fun. But last night during the race, me and Cameron's phone both, he was fighting storage problems, I was fighting battery problems. Um, so we got as much clips as we could, but looking back on it, I don't really think we missed much. There was about a 80 to 90 something lap green flag run to end the race last night and Kyle Larson just absolutely dominated, which is what I wanna kinda come on here and end this week's video with. Just talking about my overall thoughts on the race, on the weekend, uh, the pros, the cons. The actual race itself was really good, the first 50 so laps. But after Kyle Larson took the lead after the comp yellow, it was over. Like that, the race was one, the, the race might have been 200 laps, but like on lap 55 or so, whenever he took the lead on those fresh tires, 
it was over. And he was just lapping people and had like 12, 13 second leads the whole time. And second on back, it was a great race. They were side by side. There was passing as the tires wore down. It was a good race. But overall, it was a good weekend. The All-Star race itself wasn't great. The truck race, though, and the All-Star Opens were great. Um, definitely enjoyed it. Really impressed with how they renovated the facility, all the amenities, the merchandise stands, all the activities they had for the fans, the parking, the traffic really wasn't that bad. We were just dead last night, so we were just trying to worry. We are more focused on getting home um, and getting all unloaded and everything, but overall, I had a fantastic weekend. Obviously, won my Legend Car Race in Anderson on Friday. Super blessed and fortunate to be able to do that and do what I love in a competitive level, but did that Friday, and then obviously the two days with Cameron, it was absolutely phenomenal. 100%, um, if they bring it back next year, if NASCAR, if you're for some reason watching this, bring it back. We'll be there, I know for sure. I hope you guys though enjoyed. I hope this video is very informative. You guys almost hopefully felt like you were at the track with us, but that's gonna be all for me. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll be back very, very soon. More racing vlogs. More stuff with the boys, this, that, and the other. Summer 2023 is just getting underway, and it's already off with a bang. Hot start. But y'all take care. Be safe. Drop a video idea down in the comment section below. And uh, God bless.